So these are the components of a, a pain pump. We have the catheter, we have the different needles that we use to place them, and we have different tubing parts that we use to inject the local anesthetic during the, uh, during the block. Here we have one of the needles that we would use to place the catheter. So we'll use the ultrasound machine, we'll identify where the different nerves are, and then we'll select the needle size based on the, the patient and also based on what area of the body that we're doing. If we're working on a shoulder, for example, oftentimes we'll use the shorter needle. If we're, using, um, if we're doing ankle surgery, we might use the longer needle for that particular block. And then what we do is we use the catheter. The catheter is what actually stays inside of uh, the patient after surgery. And it's very fine wire. It only uh, goes under the skin. It's just a few centimeters. And then of course you have the pump with a adjustable dial that we can use to change the rate of the infusion and adjust it as necessary based on, on how you're doing.